Hey everybody, you know we get some great players from all over the world and we just got Gilad Ergas from yeah. Israel just came in and his wife Michelle and he was playing and he was playing some really great classical stuff and then he said uh, Danny Gatton and he picked this thing up and he started playing and he's a really great player so we figured uh, how long you been down for? Well, uh, for uh, two weeks. Two weeks? Yeah, just visit, vacation? Busy or? vacation for visiting my family. You're a professional Yeah, player, I right? play with uh, lots of uh, good uh, singers in uh, Israel. Great. Famous. Well, check this out. Just listen to this guy play. <laughs> you a classical guitar now this is not anything special classical but he was playing so beautifully on the classical I just wanted to play a little bit more okay so this is just this now that's a 52 telecaster by the way and it's the kind as far as if you like Danny Gatton and all that yeah, this classic, is very, very similar classic, very amazing but Unique. this, you were playing totally different style and sounded great. So. Very nice. Woo! Gilad Irgas. Now, I just want to say, you know, we get people playing from all over the world. I heard him playing some classical, and then he looked over at that Telecaster, and he said, Danny Gatton. And I'm kind of going, yeah, from Israel, you know Danny Gatton? And he plays <laughs> the hell out of this thing. So it was really entertaining. Gilad Ergas. And how can we find you on the internet or anything like that? Just to read, uh, to write my name. Okay. That's all. Gilad, G-I-L-A-D, E-R-G-A-S. This goes I, I love so much music, you know, uh, Danny Ghetto, Elvis Presley, with James Burton. And, um, really? Uh, yeah. I'm born, born to it, so. Well, he's a young man who is obviously very gifted, and we're glad to have you come in. Thank you very Gilad, much. thank you very thank much. You. Michelle, thank you very much for being patient with us. Gilad Ergas and Michelle from Israel here at Norman's Guitars.